Howdy y'all, how y'all doing? So I don't have any music today, so good for your ears. But I did want to, uh, I, well, somehow I got turned into like a luthier or something or guitar tech. I don't know. I just, I was uh, going to the hyperbaric chamber the other day and I wanted to, I was, I just wanted to bring something different. And I looked up and I saw my, one of my, well, like my favorite Les Paul copy, um, this one that I had said before that there was a big old buzz in it and I was going to be trying to fix that. And well, I was like, well, I don't really need to fix the, the, uh, the buzz because I'm not, I don't care about the electronics in the hyperbaric chamber. Who cares? But I, I, I took it down and I was tuned it up and it was like, well, the intonation is off. Okay. Well, let's just try and check that. And I couldn't get it done before I went to the, the hyperbaric chamber. So I brought a different guitar, but I, in the chamber, it's like, wait a minute. It couldn't be the neck, could it? I mean, the neck guy, it's just been sitting in either a case or, you know, hung up on a wall for on display for, I haven't really played it. I mean, could it, the neck get that out of whack? And I came back and checked and sure enough, neck was way out of whack. Uh, so we're still waiting for it to settle in a little bit. I just got it pretty straight last night and I want to make sure that it doesn't want to move anymore before I do too much more with it. But also adjusting everything, I noticed that um, the input jack, I think that's where the buzzing was coming from because I don't think it was grounded correctly. And I tried to just move, I tried to bend it a little bit so that the, the, um, the ground portion of the jack would connect a little bit better with the input jack itself. It broke off. I have another one somewhere, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna um, have to solder that on with that. Uh, and with all this, I got all these other projects that, uh, well, one that y- y'all knew about um, that is progressing a little bit, but I'm, I've been a little bit slowed. I, you know, I got, I got this one, I got th- this one that uh, I-, I wanted to make into um, a Nashville telly, which I finally got the pick guard and I you know, picked that I got, like I said, I already had, um, pickups for, uh, uh, strat uh, hanging around anyway. So, you know, I got that and I'm progressing along and going, okay. And then I got to, I know I have to take the pick, this pick guard out and then get a router and then, uh, route and route out uh, some of the wood for getting this in here. Um, pardon my dryer, uh, my washer, excuse me. That's in the background, letting me know that my wash is done. Um, but, uh, I had also ordered, uh, I, I think I had mentioned I splurged and ordered a genuine Fender five-way switch to go along with this. Um, and I, and I, I had also said that, uh, I had to push pull pots that I wanted to take one of them and, uh, see if I could get this wired so that, um, the, the, uh, neck pickup, I could get that to come on in any position that uh, I'm on. Cause I kind of, I, I got a, uh, a, a strat that I, I has that feature with a push pull pot that I absolutely love. It just sounds amazing anyway. So, um, I got the push pull pots. I couldn't, f- I can't find the switch. I got to figure out what I did with that stupid switch. Um, and, uh, yeah. So, and then while, when I was, uh, looking for the push pull pots, I was, uh, I was also you know, looking for another guitar. I'm like, Hey, wait a minute. This one that I I had for I've had for a long time, I opened it up and I was like, hey, wait a minute, this would be amazing if I could coil split these, and I opened it up and when I opened up the electronics, it's they're four wire they're already um four wire uh humbuckers the and the other two are just hanging out with a little piece of like electrical tape around them, so I'm gonna I uh, like I said I got to push bull pots. I might be able to just do this. And so now, now I'm on to, oh, weird electronics and uh, soldering. That's what I got to figure out next. So that's what I'm doing. Um, mentally, I, I'm not very all together here today. Uh, I don't know why, but um, it just seems like I need a day off or something. A day off? You don't do nothing, dude. Yeah, thank you. Um... I realize that fact, uh, but you know, so anyways, I just want to let you all know that I'm still here, still alive, still trying to do things, still trying to become a new, completely 
new person and new career, new everything. It's a little bit rough sometimes, but you know, I'm working on it. It's time I'm going to do it with a smile on my face and do it my way. Wait a minute, Frank Sinatra. Hold on, New Jersey. Anyways, hope y'all was having a great day. Always look up. I'll see you then. Peace.